Hi there, I'm Sharan Maya and I'm the UK Scotland Ambassador for the World Education Games. I'm here today with the World Ambassador for World Maths Day, Scott Flansburg. I'm just going to ask him a few questions. So Scott, why do they call you the Human Calculator? I got that nickname on television in America over 20 years ago when I was doing an interview for Regis Philbin on Regis and Kathy Lee and I demonstrated my abilities just like yours and at the end of the interview he said, you're like a human calculator and that's where I got my name. Oh, so did you train yourself to have this ability or do you feel like you've always been able to be good at maths? A little bit of both. I think I have a natural gift for numbers, but I had the passion and the enthusiasm to, tr to chase that, to try to figure out how I could be better and faster and look for more easy ways to get the answer and beat my teachers and beat the calculator. So I just always had that energy where I wanted to be faster than a machine. So I guess that's what drove me. So do you think then it's possible for just other people to become as good at maths as you? Great question and yes I believe we all have the ability to have basic number sense and that's my mission as serving the ambassador of World Maths Day is to help everybody learn this simple pattern about the number nine, how all numbers go back to nine and it will turn on everybody's calculator and now we can all learn more maths but right now we're just memorizing our basic maths and then everything falls apart in higher math. So I hope we can change the way we introduce arithmetic and numbers to students around the world. Yeah, and one last thing. A lot of people think that math is kind of uncool and they don't really like it, so why do you think that is? Well, I call myself a mathlete, and athletes are cool and we celebrate them around the world, and my job, my mission, is to make it where it's so cool to be good at maths that we celebrate mathletes as much as we celebrate athletes. So like, why do you actually think that people don't like maths? I think it's become socially accepted to be bad at maths. If you were illiterate, you wouldn't uh, say, hey, I can't read or write. It's embarrassing. But if you can't do maths, it's almost a, a badge of honor. It's almost a good thing. And, and you hear it on TV all the time. Oh, I'm no good at maths. So I think that's what's allowed it to become OK to be bad at maths. So we have to change the attitude as much as the way we introduce kids to maths. Yeah, that's quite interesting. Thanks for your time, Scott. Thank you. Great brain there. Thank you.